guys it's been a while it has been a minute or two we have been in kentucky working but we are back i am back what it do baby and we are about to pull up at rock solid motorsports got my man cj here you were driving as as i was editing a video hell yeah because of him you guys will get a video tomorrow we got to pull in here and uh this is gonna suck because I'm gonna try not to bang my trailer off that pole. Let's we'll see if I'm a truck driver today or not. Big, big, big truck driver guy. How am I doing? How am I doing? How am I doing? It's getting close to the pole now, ain't it? Oh, it's getting close to the pole, ain't it? You're good, you're good, you're gonna make it. Hey. Big, big bumper trow Oh my God, I can't talk. You had, you, you, you could, you do, you, you want, you, you could do so, you, you do, you could. A big hooked on phonics guy. Look, Steven's so excited to get this thing out of here. He is so excited. Let's see how I am backing up. Big backup camera guy. What else? Anything else that I'm big on? Uh, big oh, LDR guy. Dude, big LDR guy. Big, big sheets, sheets pizza sheets guy. Sheets pizza guy. Big sheets no. pizza guy. All right. Let's see if I can back this sucker up here. Here, we'll just give you guys the mirror view. Oh, I feel like I'm missing already. I feel like I'm going to hit something. I need, like, adult supervision because I don't know what I'm doing here. Oh, Steven's giving me so much adult. So oh, he told me to go forward. He said I missed. Bro, how embarrassing. Big, I need someone else to back up my trailer guy. <laughs> Big, I can't do this on my own. Are you here? You hold this so I back this thing up. Hey, you want some help? I do this all the time. Get back in your car with your wife. <laughs> when you're going backwards, everything's the opposite. Oh, really? Thanks, driving instructor. He's giving me like the, the hand signals. You can tell he's a dad. Oh, oh God, he's shaking his head the other way. I'm bad at this. I was, I, it's my first time. It's my first time out in the shop with a trailer. How embarrassing. Big, I need someone else to back up my trailer guy. All right. How's that looking? Right, which right? This right? Hey. He said he's gonna add to the bill because I can't back up. Damn, how embarrassing. On camera too, I generally don't film this part. It's been a long week. All right, I generally don't go running up into other people's shop filming, but with the embarrassing intro that we just had, I gotta, yeah, I gotta let you guys. Oh my god, I ain't even close. That's that's not good. I'm not a good backer upper. I don't know what happened. I must have left that in Kentucky. Sir, how are you? What's up, man? I'm I'm yeah, nervous dude. to walk around here because I know the pictures don't do it justice, and it's absolutely sick. I've not took it off the rollers until right now. Really? Yeah. Just aired up the tire. Oh my. God, the pictures don't do it any justice. Holy shit. That's wild. You've outdone yourself. Just don't fall on that. Oh my God, that is insane. Dude, it looks so good. Holy smokes. That is wild. God, I don't even know what to look at. There's so much stuff that's pretty. You killed it. Dude, give me some. You knocked out the park. 
That is wild. Holy shit. Did you have fun doing it is the question. Oh yeah, it was fun. That turbo is massive. Holy shit. Wow. This thing is gonna peel my muffin cap back blue, huh? That's serious. Dude, the turbo kit looks massive. I don't think I've seen a turbo kit that just looks that big ever before. God, everything, everything looks. The stuff we did on Jared's four inch didn't look even that big because they were kind of separated. Yeah. But since these come together, it really makes it look like a lot of pot there. All the stainless bros material, you like it? Works good? Oh yeah, it's clean. Dude, that is. Saves me a lot of work. Yeah. Yeah. That's awesome. Just wipe it off and go. You yeah, know they um they rock. They hooked it up for sure. And God, dude, everything looks. You could tell I didn't weld this one together. The ones that I got, it's like there's different little mountain ranges and snow peaks on all my welds. Dude, this thing is absolutely sick. I'll be honest with you, the the pictures you've been posting up pictures like crazy. They don't do any justice to how it looks in real life. Like it looks absolutely sick in pictures, but when you see it in person, holy shit. Dude, that is insane. That is wild. Dude. I'm excited. I'm so glad that I wasn't like, yeah, I'm going to weld the turbo kit together on this one. <laughs> oh, my God. Dude, it's sick. I got to those little things. That way you don't put the tips on quicker. You thought of everything, huh? Yeah. God, that is crazy. And then, So this tank here. First of all, I got to say, everyone, if you guys haven't been watching the Rock Solid Motorsports YouTube channel, you've been missing out. You've done pretty much breakdown videos of every single part of this entire build, and now it all comes together. You just did an overview on it. Yeah. But if you guys want to see every little thing, you did one on the tank, you did uh, one on the hot side, one on the burn down tank in the back, one on the turbo placement, like you literally step by step. It's wild. It's crazy how it comes together absolutely insane all right guys i've been staring at slick rick here for a minute absolutely blown away i've said it like i cleaned this i know i know screwed it up the first right. thing i did was come and put my hand on it but it's all right everything's going to joe so i'm going to put my pecker stamps all over this thing and then we'll stick it all in the mail send it to joe um dude absolutely killed it knocked out of the park i'm blown away everything looks it looks like it's like meant to be as built well, obviously it was built to be like this but when i brought you the box boxes full of shit the massive turbo honestly not that i i didn't doubt you but i was like i don't know how all this is going to fit how it's all going to work and you far exceeded all of my expectations this thing looks absolutely amazing and i'm just i'm blown away i'm, I'm almost whenever, speechless whenever y'all dropped it off and when we started talking about the hot side routing and stuff it I kind of had in my mind what it was going to look like anyway. I really was unsure if the merge for the downpipe was going to work, but it ended up working up like perfect, like it was meant to be. Like you built it. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> I mean, I, I know I built it, but like where the turbo position and everything was, like it couldn't have been no tighter right there. Yeah. With the clamp position, I didn't have to trim any leg length off of it or anything. It was, it was there. It looks absolutely insane. So when we brought it to you, it was just, we had the engine set in there with the headers on it and you did everything else. Um, I, I'm just like, it, it blows my mind how sick everything looks. And uh, indeed, it's just like, it's got all the little details. Like you mentioned, it's got the, the bolt holes for aligning the exhaust. You got O2 bungs on each side. I mean, it's got literally well, with these tips, if you don't have them clocked just right, the front won't go on. Oh, so now we have to. We, yeah. So now we'll know. The way the front's trimmed out, I didn't trim it any more than it already was. It's exactly how the guy had it before you. And uh, I just made the tips fit to that. So this, is this your first set of death bull horns? Yeah. yeah. I've never made a set. Like <laughs> they look absolutely, absolutely awesome. <laughs> So if somebody done that. It's game over. They're, they're done. Game over. You gotta stay away from this car in the staging lanes. That's all I can say. Lay your shin open. You know. Done. Oh, wait, listen. I've got a couple on my leg from it. I mean, you you only do that once or twice, Can't and delete. you learn real quick. Uh, I mean, dude, it's just it's absolutely sick. You've killed it. 
And then topped it off, the tank is absolutely insane. I know I got a couple other projects coming together, which I'm gonna be getting up with you. You are like the big, ta big tank guy. Burn down tanks, fuel tanks, combo tanks. You do it all. We do a bunch of them. So you guys can go over to Rock Solid Motorsports and just spam Steven with a bunch of orders. Like 10 more million tanks. Yeah, if you've got something that we don't offer, draw a sketch, email us, and we'll try to work with you within a reason. We've had some people draw us some super complicated stuff. <laughs> really don't have time to do a lot of complicated stuff, but... I will say, I've been saying it. Uh, we've got two of your burndown tanks uh, for two different Mustangs. They are probably like the nicest out there. Bang for your buck. You really can't beat it. Uh, we got one put in the Bad Apple, one going in the Blizzard. This one got one of them in there, the large yeah. burndown tank. And look, it's got, even got the, the trim ring. Like, it's it's almost like you do this for a living. Not gonna lie. See, you seem pretty good at this. And this one, we actually didn't kill you. You thought you were gonna have to drill out all the rivets for the, the carbon, right? Yeah, I actually just cheated and didn't. <laughs> <laughs> I got that on the video, but I just welded the tabs from underneath. And because it's not really holding a bunch of weight, you know, being welded on one side up against that carbon, I, I stacked some cardboard between the carbon where I didn't have to take it off. I, uh, I didn't want to have to drill out all those black rivets because then, you know, all that stuff matches and looks good. And redoing it, it probably wouldn't match. I wouldn't be able to find the stuff that they used. And, well, if it falls out going down track, then we're going to send you a met. Well, everyone just go and blame Steven. It's not going to fall out. <laughs> it's got a big X brace that goes right <laughs> under the middle of the tank. It, uh, the, everything on the car, front to back, up, down, I mean, it looks absolutely awesome. Uh, the turbo kit. Uh, everything just all the attention detail and then you mentioned i don't have it on camera but you mentioned you said in the in the driver's seat you got a couple little like fittings and stuff that we have to finish up but then you said there's a sd card yeah anytime we do a build like this i've been doing it for the past i guess two or three years but i take a ton of pictures as i go all the different processes and everything and i give that to the customer that way they can look and see exactly what all i've done that's, that's that I'd say there, that's rare. There's not anything to hide. <laughs> I, I mean, there's some stuff I don't post when I just communicate back and forth with the customer, but they can see every step of the entire build. Well, it is. And, yeah, and a build like this, I think this one's got like 300 pictures and videos. And then, uh, you know, some of them have got into the five, 600 picture range. So. Damn. Well, well documented. You guys, if you haven't seen, it was very, I'd say it was rare, There's but it was an album on our page for this car. There, it, it's it's very cool to see the progression, not only on your Facebook but the YouTube channel. See the videos; you guys can get some insight on the thought behind a lot of this stuff. Uh, so go and subscribe if you haven't already. Rock Solid Motorsports. Uh, he's got you got a bunch of videos of Slick Rick up there. Yeah, I try to take time to do videos here lately because people really enjoy them, but it is very time consuming doing the videos. So sometimes. <laughs> If I'm in a rush, you got to get shit done. You might just get the highlights. You might not get all the time lapse and all the details that that make you know fun videos. Like to have to get the work done. So. Well, this thing, uh, I, I can't thank you enough. I, I mean, dude, absolutely, just knocked out of the park. I can't wait to hear it now. You should have wired it up and plumbed it while you had it here, so we could listen to it. But this thing is just, I mean, it's awesome. So, um, super, super excited for it. Can't wait to, uh, we, now we got to do the work on our end. It was easy when you were doing the work. You know, we just got to sit back and we're like, oh, you know, here come a couple pictures from oh, Steven. It's easy to pay somebody. <laughs> I mean, if I was, you know, everybody wasn't busy, I'd pay people to do some of my stuff sometimes. Now we have to, we have to get to work. So uh, it's it looks absolutely awesome, though. This is definitely exciting now. Like, there's a lot of, exci I mean, dude, the pictures don't do it justice. It looks absolutely amazing in pictures. But when you guys see it in person, and, and I think when it gets some of that DCF love on there, it's going to be a real showstopper for okay, sure. I've been sending him some pictures, showing him what he's in store for. You gonna take a picture of my handprint? Like, yeah. I can't, like, I, you know, I, I'm sorry. I know that. I know that hurt. I know that hurt. Wipe down with glass cleaner. And <laughs> First thing I do is I gotta touch it. I'm like a little kid. I gotta touch everything. It looks absolutely sick. So, um, thank you again, everyone. Check out Steven at Rock Solid Motorsports. Uh, I mean, do this thing. You guys are gonna see a lot of videos on this now. Uh, we got to finish just a little bit, plumb it, wire it, uh, do a little bit of fab, mess with some stuff on the rear end, and uh, and we should be ready to hit the hub dyno and then the track. So uh, if you guys need any fabrication needs, you guys gotta go check out Rock Solid Motorsports. Their website has a bunch of different stuff. What's this, what is this? You, you know what my weakness is, right? 
You know what my weakness is? A black F body. And where do you find where'd you find this gem at? South Carolina. This thing is clean. So what's your what's the what's the plan with this? I'm gonna drive it. You're gonna you're gonna enjoy it? Yeah, I've got too many. We've got a race car, a race car. Race cars never run. They worry you to death. So we're gonna do big cam swap and enjoy it for a year or so. Maybe eventually do a big cubic inch oh. <laughs> NA motor. <laughs> Still keep it factory under the hood, AC. I give it a year. I come back here, you got a cage in there, a tube oh, front end. I'm not, I'm not doing none of that. <laughs> this is going to be uh, take it out and enjoy it, Carl. It, it's absolutely awesome. Well, we're going to get this thing loaded up here and get out of your hair. Steven, thank you again, dude. I, I appreciate it. Uh, I'll be watching your channel now to see what else you got going on. So if you start slacking on videos, I'm going to be like, hey, where's a video today? Uh, but this thing here, you've killed it. So uh, everyone, do me a favor. Uh, go check out Steven Rock Solid Motorsports, like their Facebook page, check them out on YouTube, and uh, I, I will proudly, proudly rock the Rock Solid Motorsports logo on this thing. It's going to be awesome. So, can't wait to go like 450s with it. We're going to be some, we're going to be some bad guys going 450s. <laughs>